is the traditional beginning of the fall political season when voters dial in and pay much closer attention. Here in Omaha, Democrat Hillary Clinton has vowed to fight for District 2. Republicans believe they will hold on to it. Reporter Nick Starling has both sides tonight. The dog days of summer are shedding light on which presidential candidates are putting time and effort into the second district so far. Tuesday night, the Clinton campaign opened up their second headquarters in Omaha. We're gratified because that was what part of what will activate uh, this community, the fact that this campaign has had the respect to be here. Clinton supporter Preston Love Jr. says the offices popping up around Omaha shows the community how invested the Clinton campaign is to winning here. This campaign has made a commitment to North Omaha by having an office. They have many staff members here that they're paying, and uh, that's a big decision in a red state. Whereas Trump supporters like Hal Dobb think otherwise. Putting a huge investment in an office here uh, didn't seem to our campaign committee like a prudent investment. Dobbs says right now the campaign is sitting comfortably, focusing more on social media. Our optimism might be proven to you by the fact that we haven't employed 20 people in an Omaha office for Donald Trump. Recent polls are split. UNO political science professor Paul Landau weighed in on the tight race. It's pretty clear that Hillary Clinton's thinking she can win this thing. Landau says it's telling by the amount of effort spent on offices and TV ads spent by the campaigns. Trump people don't seem to be making any sort of investment in the second district, at least not yet. Landau says if polling stays the way it is for Trump nationally, the campaign may fly over the second district. Trump may write it off because he's got so many bigger fish to fry. Nick Starling reporting tonight, Hillary Clinton has promised to come back to Omaha and dance in the streets with Warren Buffett if she wins District 2. Republicans said tonight they plan to open a Trump campaign office in the next couple of weeks. A third party.